a group of highly established alumni gathered to visit their former university professor. The conversation between them soon turned into complaints about their stressful work and life. The teacher went to his kitchen and returned with a large cup of coffee and a selection of mugs, including porcelain, plastic, glass, crystal, some ordinary, some expensive, and some exquisite. The teacher asked them to pour themselves coffee. After all the students had a cup of coffee in their hands, the teacher said, Have you noticed that all the beautiful cups are taken and only the cheapest are left? Although it is normal for everyone to want the best for themselves, it is the source of problems and stress in their life. The cup itself does not escalate the taste of the coffee. In most cases, it is more expensive and hides what we drink. The teacher continued, What everyone desired was coffee, not the cup. But everyone consciously picked nice expensive cups and then started looking at each other's cups. Let's consider that life is coffee and jobs, houses, cars. Things, money and positions are cups. The type of drink we have does not define or change our quality of life. Moral, sometimes we cannot enjoy coffee concentrating only on the cup we have. Being happy does not mean that everything around you is perfect. This means that you have decided to look beyond imperfections and find peace. And peace resides in you, not in your career, work, or the houses you have. Thanks for watching my video. Please like, share, and subscribe.